everybody, so it's my turn to cook something from one of our many cookbooks, and Sue is taking a turn behind the camera with directing. So we're going to basically be cooking a cornbread recipe today for our, uh, our many cookbooks, uh, so it's a uh, bake by Love Food. So for today's recipe, you're going to need 140 grams of fine cornmeal polenta, 140 grams of plain flour, four teaspoons of baking powder, two teaspoons of celery salt, so we've basically done uh, one teaspoon of garlic powder and one teaspoon of table salt, uh, a teaspoon of black pepper, uh, 55 grams altogether of parmesan, but I'll split this into 40 grams for actually mixing through, and then 15 grams for the top, two beaten eggs, 400 millilitres of milk, uh, 55 grams of uh, melted butter, the original recipe, of course, was just a bunch of spring onions, chopped spring onions. I decided to add a little kit to it by adding a heaped dessert spoon of jalapenos finely chopped. And for actually cooking in, we're going to be using a pre-greased uh, uh, baking tray, normally around 23 by 23, or sort of whatever you can, uh, whatever you can use. And we're going to put it into a preheated oven at 190 degrees Celsius. So the first part of the recipe is we're going to basically sieve all the dry ingredients first. So that's the polenta, the flour and the baking powder. The salt, pepper and the garlic powder. I'm going to mix through the 40 grams of parmesan. Okay, so the next step of the uh, recipe is to basically beat together all your uh, wet ingredients. So that's the eggs. Melted butter. And the milk. and there we go. So the next step of the recipe, we're basically going to combine everything and actually get it into the uh, baking tray. So I'm going to combine my uh, beaten wet ingredients. And mix these up. Try and remove any lumps. So after giving, my, uh, giving myself lots of extra steps on the Fitbit and giving my arm a bit of a workout, I'm going to add the uh, vegetables. So this is the spring onions and the jalapenos. And again, just mix them through. I'm going to take my prepared baking tray try pouring the batter into the tray. Always on, maybe I'll do that left handed. Spread it out evenly within the tray. Give it a shake. I'm going to basically put the remaining uh, parmesan, sprinkle that over the top. Get it going. Avoid 
get it all in one lump. Okay, that's now ready to go into the oven. So again, reminder, 190 degrees C oven. And it's gonna be going in there for 30 to 35 minutes or until four thin and golden. Okay, so that's looking absolutely excellent, smelling absolutely gorgeous. Um, this was after 30 minutes at 190 degrees Celsius or on our fan oven 170. Okay, so we've turned it out onto a cooling rack. Um, we're probably going to cut this into uh, around 16 pieces. Um, 